Welcome to Great Noise University. I am Michael Sargavakian, and this module is part of our Great Noise API and CLI training series. In this module, we will be introducing you to the Great Noise CLI and SDK. Access to the CLI and SDK are available to all of our users. The Great Noise Python SDK is the preferred library for interactions with the Great Noise API for implementing integrations. It also provides a CLI to call the Greennoise API directly from the command line. To view the source code, submit issues, and provide feedback, you can visit our GitHub repo. You can also navigate to our Python docs for more comprehensive material. Since the CLI and SDK are Python based, you need to ensure that your system has an appropriate version of Python installed. Currently, the CLI and SDK support Python 3.6 and higher. In order to use the CLI and SDK, the Greenways Python module needs to be installed into your Python environment. You can follow the quick start instructions and run either pip install Greenways or python setup.py install to install the module. For the CLI, you'll need to make sure to configure the client with your API key and any other settings needed. You can set up your API key by using the following command. Graynoise setup dash K and enter your API key. The Python modules provide a series of commands that can be used with any custom Python scripting to simplify interacting with the Graynoise API. Additionally, it includes a set of commands that can be run at the CLI for quick access to the tool. We will go into details to use each of these in later sessions, but here's an overview of the commands available. Analyze, which is how you can take a log file and do a bulk analysis against the gray noise data. Filter is a command to narrow down our searches. IP, used to look up a single IP address. IP multi, look up multiple IPs in a search. Query, allows you to query the gray noise data sets using the gray noise query language. Quick, quickly checks whether or not an IP address has been seen in the last 90 days. Write, checks if the IP address is part of our Riot data set. Similar is used to see similarities between an IP address and any others within the Gray Noise dataset. Stats will give you a summary of metadata from a query. And the timeline command allows you to see day by day granular view of an IP scanning history and activity. These are all active lookup commands, and there are also a few utility commands as well. We can check the current version by running Gray Noise version. While the SDK is designed to be fully functional for users with the paid subscription or VIP level access, the IP command does support our community users and allows for IP-based lookups at the CLI or via scriptings using the same method as the full access users. In order to configure the command line interface to use the community API for IP lookups, run the following command. Gray noise setup dash API key and enter your API key dash O for offering in community. This concludes this training module. If you have any questions on the topics covered, please reach out to support at graynoise.io.